at the root of the democratic revival in Philadelphia was race. Democrats after the Civil War were in no position to protest the accomplishments of Abraham Lincoln, the successes of the Republican Party on the battlefield, but they were in a position to deal with the specter of race. Because now that emancipation had freed the South slaves, those same slaves were free to come north, to do as Democratic opponents during the war had always prophesied would happen. Free blacks would come north, compete with white immigrants, white Irish immigrants, for work. And now Democrats are handed by this an opportunity to say, all right, we're not going to contest the war issues anymore. We're not going to talk about Abraham Lincoln. What we are going to talk about is this influx of a black population which is taking away jobs from upstanding white people, especially Irish immigrants, who have come to America and continue to come to America through the 19th century in tremendous numbers, and who are looking for opportunities only to find that they can be undersold by Philadelphia's black population. That creates an economic enmity which democratic politicians are very eager to exploit. And to exploit it not only in Philadelphia, but in many other major urban situations.